it's Miss Joy and I am back with another lesson for you today. We are going to talk about solving a problem. So first we're going to go through the steps, then we're going to read a story, and last we're going to talk about what was the problem in our story. All right, when there's a problem we have four steps. Can you count them with me? One, two, three, four. Nice counting. Did you bring four fingers with you today? Show me four fingers. One, two, three, four. Good job, friends. All right, our first step is we have to ask ourselves, is there a problem? Look at, he's like, he's kind of being silly. Is there a problem? Next, we have to think of some choices to solve our problem. So first, we ask if there's a problem. Then, we think of different choices. Our third step, friends, is to make a plan. Make a plan. What could you do to solve the problem? And our last step is to go. First, we ask if there's a problem. Then we think of choices. Third, we make a plan. And then we go. We have to solve our problem. All right, friends, it is time to read our story. My story today is There is a Bird on Your Head by Mo Williams. Remember, Mo Williams is the author, and the author is the person that wrote the story. Let's find out what happens. There is a bird on your head. Here he comes. Uh oh, look, he's going to land on Elephant's head, friends. <gasps> Piggy! Is there something on my head? Yes. There is a bird on your head. There is a bird on my head? Is there a bird on my head now? No. Now there are two birds on your head. Friends, look at his face. Does he look happy? No, he does not. What are two birds doing on my head? They are lovebirds. The birds on my head are in love? They are lovebirds, Piggy said. Lovebirds? How do you know they are lovebirds? They are making a nest. Two birds are making a nest on my head? Why would two birds make a nest on my head? Friends, it sounds like Elephant has a problem. I'm afraid to ask. Do I have an egg on my head? One, two, three. You have three eggs on your head. I do not want three eggs on my head. Then I have good news, Piggy says. The eggs are gone? The eggs are hatching! Hatching? The eggs on my head are hatching? Cheep, 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 cheep. They have hatched. Piggy says. I do not want three baby chicks, two birds, and a nest on my head. Friends, does Elephant have a big problem now? Yes, he does. Where do you want them? Somewhere else! He was shouting. 
why not ask them to go somewhere else? Ask them? Ask them. Okay, I will try asking. Excuse me, birds, will you please go somewhere else? No problem. It worked. Bye. Chief, chief, chief. Now there are no birds on my head. Thank you, Piggy. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Friends, where did the birds go? Yup, they went onto Piggy's head. The end. All right, friends, let's go through our steps. Was there a problem in my story? Yes, there was a problem. What was the problem? Look, problem starts with P. What was the problem? Yes, the problem was, it's hard to write it and hold it. Um, birds on elephants head. That was the problem. There were birds on elephants head. All right, friends, now what choices could elephant do to solve the problem? What could he do? Piggy gave him a choice. Piggy told him to, can you see it if it's down here? Yes. Piggy told him to ask birds to leave. So he could ask the birds to leave. What else could Elephant do to solve his problem, friends? Oh, I like how you're thinking. I have an idea. He could take the nest off. He could take the nest off his head. That would solve the problem, right? Can you think of anything else? All right, so we figured out there was a problem. There was birds on elephant's head. And we thought of some choices. He could ask the birds to leave or he could take the nest off. Now he needs to make a plan. He needs to figure out what is he gonna do. He decided he was gonna ask the birds to leave. So he went, he did it. He asked the birds to leave and they did. And then where did the birds go? The birds went onto Piggy's head. You are right. Friends, what great listeners you were today. Thank you so much for joining me today. I'll be back next week with another story that has another problem. And I'm going to wear some cool glasses in next week's video. So make sure you stop by and see me.